Hello yogis and welcome to my channel. I'm La Mike and today we have a bedtime yoga session to help us wind down for the night and have a peaceful, sweet, sweet, sweet night. If you like this kind of content, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you don't miss out on my new videos. Let's get started. We're going to start today in a hero pose. So for the hero pose, just bring your feet together and sit on your feet. So your knees are touching, sit on your feet and try to lift, tuck in your belly button and lift your crown, coming to the middle of the mat. Just lift your crown and feel the stretch along the back of your feet. Inhale and exhale through the nose. We'll stay here for a couple of breaths. And if you want, you can flip your palms up, palms facing up as a sign of acceptance and surrender. Inhale through the nose, in and out. You can set an intention for your night, an intention to guide you through your practice. Take a deep breath in. And now through the mouth, let's move to child's pose. So just tuck in your chin and roll your body towards the front of the mat. Bring your skull to the mat. Just lift your legs where they are and bring your hands to the mat, your palms still facing up. We want to calm down from the day we've had. Settle down and slow down for the night. Inhale through the nose, in and out. Child's pose helps us to feel grounded, to feel calm. It also massages our skull, our head. It also helps us relieve headaches. So if you're going through a hard time or stressful day, it's just good to take a couple of breaths in the child's pose. Bring your hands to the front of your mat. Lift to all fours. Bring your hands to the front and shift your legs to the back. Bring your upper body to the mat and just lie on your belly. Take a couple of breaths here. And we're going to slide up into a sphinx pose. So lift your upper body up. Bring your elbows underneath your shoulders. And take a couple of breaths in the swing pose. Shine your heart forward. You're in a slight back bend. And look to the front of your mat. You can plant the back of your feet on your mat. And your hands are on the mat. Inhale and exhale. In the night, I just like to surrender. Surrender to a higher power. Surrender all manipulation control. So I invite you to flip your palms up. You can also just flip your palms up and just take the surrender, acceptance. Inhale in through the nose, in and out. And try to lift your chest up, open your heart space. And just shine the light that's in you, out into the world, out into your room. Two more breaths here, through the nose, in and out. And we'll move into a cobra from this, from this, from here. So bring your chest back to the mat. Bring your skull to the mat. Bring your hands underneath your elbows. Bring your elbows closer to your body. Your hands underneath your shoulders. Inhale, lift your chest. Lift your hands from the mat to make sure you're lifting with your upper body. That you're using the strength from your back to lift. Tuck in your belly button. Exhale, bring your hands to the mat and push all the way up to so all fours. Bring your knees underneath your hips and move with your hands towards your knees. Lift your body and come to this knee stand. You can tuck your toes and we're going to move into a camel pose. For the camel pose, I'm going to give you vari variations and you can go just as far as it's possible for you. 
so you can bring your hands to your back this is already the first part and just look up instead to lift your chest to the front and bend your back just go as far as it's possible for you and you want to make sure you can breathe no matter how far you're going and you may want to stay here if you feel like going deeper in the camel pose it's a little difficult to talk in the camel pose so if you feel like going deeper bring your left hand to your left foot right hand to right foot and shine your chest forward your pelvis to the front and take a couple of breaths here we're in a back bend and a heart opener release tension in your body inhale and exhale through the nose and when you're ready to come back up bring your left hand back to your back and your right hand back tuck your chin to chest and then roll all the way up stand up tall and then sit your knees sit on your knees on your feet bring your chin to chest and round and take a little child's pose here to balance to counter the back bend in here in an exhale through the nose and bring back your hands towards your head place your hands on the mat lift up and come to a comfortable seat so that we can go into butterfly pose so sit on your mat bring your feet to the front and bring your let your feet touch both feet and just open your hips left and right close your eyes if you want to and you can just use your thumbs to massage the balls of your feet just give yourself a light massage here while letting your feet fall left and right a little so much a little bit is can be much so a little can go a long way so you don't need to do so much here just inhale and exhale and let your knees fall towards the mat relax in your body relax your shoulders relax your hips your knees your feet and sit up tall Inhaling through the nose, in and out. Let your knees fall out. Two more breaths here. And when you're ready, bring your knees together. And make your way to lying on your back. We'll come to a Shavasana. Take a short break in your back. Take two breaths here. And here, and then exhale through the nose. Plant your feet on the mat. Your knees facing up. Bring your back, the whole of your lower back on the mat. Your whole back on the mat. Tuck your chin to chest. Open your, knee, your, your feet as wide as your hips and just let your he knees fall to the right. You can lift your hands beside your body or if you want to, you can stretch your hands, open your hands left and right or make cactus arms if you don't have enough space. So find a position with your hands and both shoulders are on the mat. If you want to go deeper in this pose, you can bring your right ankle on your left knee to help guide your left knee towards the mat. You may need to move your feet a little more but make sure that your shoulders are on the mat. Inhale and exhale through the nose. Relax your body. Release your left, your right ankle from your left knee. Bring it back to the mat. And then lift both knees all the way up. 
Bring your whole lower back to the mat and then let your knees fall to the left. Both shoulders are on the mat. Inhale and exhale through the nose. You want to go deeper here too. Bring your ankle on your right knee, your left ankle on your right knee. And make sure that both shoulders are on the mat, especially your right shoulder. So if your right shoulder is lifting from the mat, you may want to lift both feet on the mat. Inhale and exhale through the nose, soften through your body. A couple more breaths here. And gently release, bring your left foot back to the mat and lift your legs up to the sky. Bring your walk in your feet about hip wide apart. Bring your back to the mat, bring your hands left and right beside your body. And when you're ready, we'll move into a shoulder bridge. So lift your, your um, tuck in your belly button, lift your pelvis. And then lift your glutes from the mat, lift your lower back from the mat. Your shoulders, your upper back is still on the mat. And if you want, you can interlace your fingers and pull them towards your feet. Shine your chest forward, chin to chest. Inhale and exhale. Hold and breathe. We'll stay here for three. Breathe. Two, smile, one, release the fingers and bring your upper body back to the mat and pull in your knees to your chest and give yourself a big hug, hug your knees, smile, give yourself some love. When you're ready, release your hug and stretch your legs, relaxing your whole body. Thank your body for carrying you throughout the day. Thank your mind for guiding you throughout the day. Relax your body. With an inhale, you can repeat, I relax my body. Exhale, I relax my body. Inhale, I relax my body. Exhale, I relax my body. Repeat this three more times, which are inhale and exhale. We're going to do the same for our mind, relaxing our mind for the night. So inhale, I relax my mind. Exhale, I relax my mind. Inhale, I relax my mind. Exhale, I relax my mind. And repeat this also three times in your own pace.
Bring your hands to heart center. Feel the gratitude in your body, in your mind. And thank your body for this practice. Thank yourself for doing something conscious before going to bed, something mindful. You can stay in Shavasana as long as you may need or just throw off your blanket and just continue your night. I'm going to leave you here. The light and the love in me recognizes the light and love in you. Thank you for your time. Thank you for practicing with me. Namaste.